Hey everyone, welcome back to my kitchen. I'm Kate, founder of Noto, and today we are making homemade Zinger burgers. Now, usually I avoid making recipes with a long list of ingredients, but I promise you, like everything we make in the Noto at Home kitchen, this recipe is so easy. So let's get cooking. Okay, to make this recipe, you're just going to need our 11 herbs and spices mix, one cup of plain gluten-free flour, one egg, and 500 grams of um, chicken breast. So the first step is to grab your 11 herbs and spices. We're gonna have the full recipe in our captions below, so just check that out. And we're gonna place it into our food processor. I'm just using a Thermomix, but obviously um, you can just use any type of food processor. These herbs and spices smell absolutely amazing. Now for 500 grams of chicken, you really only need like half this. So what I do is I just put the other half into some Tupperware and keep it in the fridge to make next week. Because your family's gonna love this recipe. <laughs> so we're just gonna crack one egg into a separate bowl. Whisk that up. Okay, so now we're gonna coat the chicken. So we just pop the chicken in the egg and then transfer it to here. The key is to have one wet hand and one dry hand. <laughs> now, if you're like me and you like a really good coating on your chicken, then you've got to go in for the, for the double coat. So we'll pop that back into the egg mixture. And then coat again. Beautiful. I'm just gonna go wash my hands and then we're gonna pop them into the, the fry pan for, in a shallow fry just to cook those off. Okay, so now it's time to build our burgers. So we have our uh, toasted gluten-free buns. Uh, we have our zinger fried chicken, Swiss cheese, freshly sliced tomato and some lettuce. And we've got a uh, sriracha mayo here. So this is a family favorite of ours and we make this every week now. Uh, so let's go. I love making these recipes at home. They're so fun. And we're, all, we're using all beautiful ingredients. Let's just go the whole breast. I think we're gonna go double mayo to both sides. So delicious. A nice kick with that sriracha mayo too. Yum. Thank you so much for watching. I know you're gonna love this recipe. If you are making these recipes at home, we would love to see them. So please make sure that you tag Nodo at home and don't forget to like and subscribe. <laughs> you can cut that out. <laughs> I was watching how to make the perfect schnitzel and he's like, you need one wet hand and one dry hand because I have them totally caked. Cake cap. You're so proud of me. This is so good.